Hi teammates If you listen to this song Even Kendrick Lamar talks about the rapture So it's, it's coming up We'll listen to that Okay, so he's even Kendrick Lamar is talking about the rapture, and we know how deep into the occult his symbolism goes, showing the like the tricks of the ghetto and how when he came out of the ghetto in L.A. and um, just showing how it's all a setup by the mostly white elite. And so don't turn this into a race thing. Don't be racist. You know, we're all God's children. And um, even the fallen angels, they can be saved if they return to Jesus, you know, which is what Jonathan Clegg kind of says. So um, I've got this here. Haiti, Free Soil and Anti-Slavery in the Revolutionary Atlantic by Ada Ferrer. Um, if you look that up, it talks about Jem, um, who is one of seven escaped slaves who were on a schooner or a schooner. I don't, I'm not sure how you say it, but they, they basically went on a ship and they, they knew how to, how to man a ship, uh, from the time that they were slaves. And they sailed um, to Haiti and were um, freed there. They, they gained their freedom. And the ship was called Deep Nine. So I thought this article had a lot of symbolism. And I'm looking at Jem as possibly somebody who I could have been or somebody on the team. Uh, just look at this for what it is. And um, the symbolism of the town. Um, the movie The Town that came out with Ben Affleck and Jeremy Renner. Jeremy Renner played Jim, um, or Jim. He kind of had both names and, um, it, it's about, it's about sacrifice for the family, basically, is what that movie is about. And, um, you know, to get the, to get the gold, to get the, to rob the bank, um, and get the, get the jewels for Jesus, you know, is the, is the symbolism there. Don't do anything crazy. I'm just saying what the symbolism is of robbing the bank. That's what they do in the movie. So very interesting. Um, July 12th, 2002 is road to perdition release date. I've got that on there because, um, I believe that the angel with the power over time is my great, great grandfather, Noel of Assur. Um, who married a Native American queen or, or princess. And, uh, he was a, he was a trader up by the Great Lakes in Kankakee area. And he's known as one of the fathers of Kankakee. And, um, and he, he was French and he told the, uh, the Native American, uh, king, that he had a dream that um, he he gave him land because um, the Native American Keen had said he had a dream. The king had a dream that um, Noah Vassour gave him his horse. So the princess was like, yeah, give my dad your horse. You know, it's that's the law here. If you have a dream, you have to do it. So and then he said, well, how am I going to get the land? And the princess said, oh, just tell my dad you had a dream about him giving you the land. So he did, and then the French got that land there. And um, I believe he has power over time, um, spoken of in Revelation, that there should be time no longer. The angel with the, the face like the sun and all, and all that. So um, just look that up when you get a chance. And 
Road to Perdition, I, I've got that there because Road to Perdition was filmed in Kankakee area. So, and I'm kind of looking at the Perdition with the Revelation 17 symbolism as being part of the, the angel over time and all that stuff. So, just keep faith. And uh, so, Road to Perdition to January 22nd, that's Heath Ledger's death, is Bob 1, or 2021 20, days. So, it's just like the hands being made, the hoof, the hoofs being made brass. And, you know, when uh, Heath Ledger comes out of the hospital, he's showing that his hoofs were made brass. Um, and then uh, Road to Perdition to November 30th, 2013, that's Paul Walker, is 4160 days. So, you could take that four, you could take that one six and make it a seven. It would be the the death adder there, the four the four seven zero days. Okay, Hendrik Goldzius is the Holy Ghost, is what I'm finding, and he has power over fire. So look him up when you get a chance. And Road to Perdition to the New World film UK release date is what that says there. Sorry, it's hard to read. UK release is uh that's January twenty seventh, two thousand six, and it's one two. Nine, six days. It's like one biff days. And that's the New World film release date. Okay, so, and then we got January, or excuse me, July 12th, 2002. That's Road to Perdition. To um, August 1st, 1574. That's Heemskirk, Martin Van Heemskirk, who is the Yellow Flame and 